Hey everybody, welcome back to another Oklahoma Kayak Spotlight Series video. I hope you had a chance to get on the water this week. Today we're going to be going over the Jackson Kayaks Liska boat. So some quick specifics about the boat. It's 12 foot, 1 inches long, 34 inches wide, has a 400 pound capacity and is 84 pounds. With it being 34 inches wide and having such a good weight capacity, it's going to be great for fishing. You'll be able to stand in it and bring all the gear you want. If we drop right into the features, up front, you've got your grab handle, which is really nice. It's a rubber one, more comfortable than most. Moving down, you have your usual center hatch. It's got some bungees on it, which you can use to shove your paddle blade up and not have to worry about it going everywhere. Or you could clip some dry bags to it. It's just there to have. Open up the hatch. That gives you access to the hole, of course, and there's plenty of room to put stuff in there. There's a lot of space to put all your gear, some dry bags, some overnight camping gear, whatever you want. Right behind that, there's the stand assist strap. So again, 34 inches wide, it's gonna be great for standing. This stand assist strap makes it even easier to get up and down into your seat comfortably and quietly too. So you don't scare fish or anything. Move a little farther back, you've got a really large center console here. A uh, cool thing about it is it has a small slide track on the top of it. So it's great for putting your fish finder unit right there in front of you. And there's plenty of room inside of it for a small like lithium ion battery to charge your fish finder and whatnot. And there's a scupper hole inside the console as well where you can run your transducer down. And the hole of the boat, there's actually a special mold under there that fits most transducers really well. So it's really, I guess, equipped for a fish finder really well. And you can also put some plastics in there, some of your line, whatever you want to have readily accessible right in front of you. To the left and right of that, you have adjustable foot pegs, so you've got those micro adjustments to get the boat comfortable for you. And on the sides of that, you've got some longer slide tracks, so any yak attack, ram ball, anything that utilizes the bolt and track, you can slide up in there and again, accessorize the boat to your liking. On the deck, you have deck padding, so again, 34 inches wide, you got the sand assist strap deck padding. This boat's going to be great for standing, so anybody doing sight fishing or even fly fishing, there's not many hang-ups up here in this front deck area, so if you're fly fishing and you're stripping line, you're not worried about that getting hung up. If we move down to the sides again, you've got grab handles on the side, so moving the boat around by yourself. It is 84 pounds, but these side handles make it easier to do that, so if you're going pond guys, if you're going out by yourself, it's easier to move around. You also have a paddle bungee right here that you can put the paddle lengthwise down the boat. So that means if you don't want to use the bungees up front, you can put the paddle lengthwise down the boat and when you pull up to your spot, you don't have to worry about your paddle falling in the water or whatnot when you're fighting a fish. Move down to the seat. The seat itself is on slide tracks, so you can adjust it forward, backward, again, just to get it to your liking. You can change the weight distribution to get it how you prefer it. A seat also has a high and low, and all it is is it's secured in by a couple pins in the front. So you pull out those pins, and then all it is is pulling the seat up, getting it in the high spots, and you're good to go. You've got that height advantage on the fish. You can sight fish, do whatever you want up there. The seat itself, like all Jackson seats, it's really comfortable, padded well. It's got a high back. It's wide. It's ventilated. You're not going to have a problem spending multiple hours on the water in this boat. Like all Jackson boats, again, it comes outfitted with a little goodie bag. So you get your ramrod holder, get your cup holder or your cup, and then red flag, and the sand assist strap also comes in the goodie bag. So when you buy the boat, you don't have to spend a bunch of money on accessories getting it out in the water. You can buy the boat, grab your paddle, go out to your favorite lake and start catching some big ones. You got a little bit of room behind the seat as well to store some stuff and under the seat. So if you wanted to keep some of your, I guess, more commonly used crankbaits, like I've got all my favorite tackle right under me so I don't have to turn around and grab stuff, make a bunch of noise. You can keep that all under you. If you move back to the tank well, you have two flush mount rod holders that come standard with the boat so you don't again you can take all your gear out with you the day you buy the boat you don't have to worry about outfitting that that much the rear tank well is also plenty big so you will not have a problem fitting all your tackle or your cooler or even both or if you go camping you have plenty of room for overnight gear back there on either sides of the tank well you have some more slide tracks so again anything that goes in there you can put in there so if you want to put your light back here some rod holders back here it just helps you accessorize the boat to your liking even easier if we jump to the very back of the boat it is power pull ready there's a spot for flush uh, four inserted screw threads in there so mounting a power pull is super easy and it also comes it's not rudder ready but it is capable of putting a rudder on there you just have to do a bit of drilling and changing out some cable and you can get your rudder on there and also there's some grooves right here 
where you could run a drag chain, an anchor, that's just right there for you. So that's pretty much the boat. The boat itself comes in at 1349, so a little bit above a thousand. So if you're looking to upgrade your like 500, 600 dollar boat, get into something a bit nicer, more comfortable, Jackson List is great for that. It's going to be really, it's going to shine in smaller lakes, larger ponds. On larger lakes, it is a shorter boat, so it's not going to do that great, but it'll still, it's 34 inches wide, you're not going to have a problem in some trap or anything. But ponds as well, get it out by yourself, it's a shorter boat, it's really maneuverable. You know, it's going to be great on rivers, so you river guys, fly fishing for smallmouth and trout, this will be a really good boat for that, kind of like a less expensive, a bit easier to handle mayfly, so it's, it's also barely over 12, so putting it in the bed of a truck is not going to be an issue, transporting it's not going to be too bad. But that's the Jackson Liska. Uh, there's not many, not much else to it. If you have any questions, please drop a comment. We'll get back to you as soon as we can. And uh, come check us out at 220 Northwestern Avenue in Oklahoma City. Take the boat out for yourself on the river, rent it for the weekend, your favorite pond, and uh, tell us how you like it. Thanks for tuning in, and we'll catch you next week.